big chunk of me just wants to crawl back into bed and forget about the world for today. Uh, this man flu, bug, cold, whatever it is, properly got hold of me. My mouth is like I've been, I don't know, it's like chewing a badger's jock strap. Unfortunately for me, I can't actually not do anything today because Chris and Tim are back today and as far as I'm aware, the plan is to get this leg up this end, that leg up that end, the leg up over there on the back of the little barn and get up as many panels as we can today. That's, that's as far as I'm aware what they're planning to do. <clears throat> so I've already been down and moved the dumper, scratched the top off there, which I know roughly where the... Um, hole is going, but until we put a plumb line down, I don't want to dig a massive hole because it means I've got to buy more concrete. Yeah. Uh, news on the little red calf, I shut them in last night and my cunning plan did work. I didn't video it this morning because very first thing this morning I felt awful. Um, I nearly let them out and didn't actually tag the calf, but then I said, book your ideas of it Ian, get on with it. So, so I did. So yeah, all the calves are now tagged. Right, well the guys aren't due here for another hour, but what I'll do is I'll warm up the MXU, I'll put the shredder back on, um, I'll put the PT on I think, I might actually just chew that lump up in there, I might as well, uh, while I'm waiting for them, and then when the guys get here, we'll get into the integrity of doing a bit more on the barn. I'm not going to promise great things today, because cause I just don't feel like it. <coughs> that hurts. So just give it a minute. I'll have a bit too. That was a struggle getting that on there. The prop shaft sleeve was all cold and very dry. It did not want to go on. So now I'm puffing and panting even more. Alright, and yeah, I've done it, it's on there. Just need to get this out of here now, and when the guys turn up, they can make a start putting the concrete panels in here because my guys have got the cherry picker for a minute. They won't be finished for that for another hour. By which time, hopefully, we can then get the legs up over there if it all goes to plan. Chewing up. I'll go make the guys a cup of coffee.
Oops. Oh, don't worry, your mate will give you enough. I'll see you tomorrow at football. I'll get him to give you another pair. Yeah. Oh, dear. That's two. Yeah. I'm standing back. Over there. Twist me out and get on there. Yeah, I've done to that. Bear in mind, this is a club line for doing footings. Yeah. Well, gravity should work the same way. Yeah. Just the length of it. All oh, right. Oh my god. There. All right. That's wood. I'm having my doubts that today's video is going to get edited tonight. You might have to go without it for a day. Clean it there, really. I'm not happy with that. Right, go back clean out. That's better. Oh, right, okay. How old's that? Not that old. Yeah? It's done a fair bit, though. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's not a lot of scope to get the mag drill in there, look. No.
<laughs> Sorry for the lack of narration. Talkies are at work. one that's the other one that's right your favourite bit yeah yeah, yeah. I can't hear anything anyway. Which one do you put that down to? Door one, two, or three? Yeah, something like that. Well, that's my last hole. Not a massive hole, because I've got to mix all this concrete in my hands, remember? Just uh, to get the beam, put them in there. And that's that bit then. I may not do much more today. I've kind of had it. I feel rotten. We'll see. You can't go to bed, but I feel even more rotten. Alright. I'm going to leave them to make some a bit of concrete to put around the feet. Just so they can get everything leveled and set up. I've only got about three quarters of a ton of aggregate here, so they can't fill the holes up even if they want to. So I'll get some more, mix some more, but for today I just want the feet set in the right position. We've got about six inches, six, seven inches of gap underneath each of the feet. They're all floating in midair for a minute. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. Good job. Do you remember a few days ago, I told you that I'd broken my little GoPro. GoPro selfie stick or what I call it the shorty mini extension pole and this was the third one this year that I'd broken um, so this one was I went back and looked on Amazon what I paid for it 24 pounds 97p and I think well hang on that's I've already broken three so it's like 75 quid on on that so when I went in looking for it I actually thought maybe I'll, I'll try something different so I brought one of these fellas the Bluetooth, the Blue Car selfie stick, which was £10.99, and the Ulanzi similar sort of things selfie stick, which was £15.99. So that was kind of nine quid cheaper, and that was about 14 quid cheaper. So, yeah, like, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I'm going to use both of these um, selfie stick thingies. And in a week or so, I'll let you know which one I prefer and whether I would go back to the GoPro zone. Once I get into the box. I'm actually feeling a little bit better this evening. When I say a little bit, that's the same as I'm not feeling any worse. What have we got here? Oh, it's quite Bulky. Right. Okay, well it says it's compatible with the GoPro. So we will have to see. I expect there's a mate to go on there or something. Uh, right, okay. Hmm. Don't go away. That's that one. I've got a feeling this is going to be the better one of the two. For me because it's smaller. I like a selfie stick that I can just stick in your pocket that fits in there. So if I haven't got the radio mic on, um, this along with the GoPro fits in my shirt pocket. So it's discreet. Yeah. There we go. That's probably more like it. Jewish 
stabbed? Yes, you do. All right. Well, we'll see how long you last. It's still quite plastic. I don't think I can use that though. Wonder if it's the same as that. That one. Yeah. I'm not going to use that. Right. Watch this space. Uh, hopefully tomorrow I'll be even better, and I might even be mildly interesting. But I doubt I'll be very interesting at all today. I haven't even interested myself. <laughs>